my geek box. This is June's box. It's arrived really early. So I'm like, wow, they're on schedule. Impress me straight away. Straightforward box. One price, no subscription saves. It's just a monthly reoccurring subscription. 20 pound a month, box sense here, but um, no themes, just straightforward. 20 pound and four items. They've removed the t-shirt a long time ago. It just seems to be 20, 20 pound, four items a month, and they're gonna be geeky items. Let's see what we got in this one's box. What's up, dudes and dudettes, all you awesome people. Welcome to the Geeky Heaven channel. I am Glenn, the Geeky Heaven, here with June's My Geek Box. So, I don't pay for this. This is sent to me by the team over at My Geek Box for review purposes. But if you were to purchase one of these, link in the description down below if you're interested. These are £20 a month and you can cancel at any time basically. It's just, it's still sealed so we just open it up and see. It's a bigger box so is there a big item or is there a lot of packaging? Let's see. Oh, there is a lot of packaging. There's a lot, a lot of packaging. I've just seen all four items. So, yeah, not a good month for me. Boxes in a way. You've seen me unbox these previously. Uh, I don't know if it's this set or not. Big Bang Theory, and these are the Pixel. Are these just called Pixel? Yeah. This is Pixel 0002. Or 002. And you see it's Shel Sheldon, Raj, Howard, and Bernadette. It's just pixelated figures from the show. Big Bang Theory, and on the reverse there is the other set you can get, which was Shel uh, Gre Sheldon Green Lantern, Amy Leonard Penny. I'm not sure if I have this set or the other one now. I will have to find out where I put them when I unboxed them last time. I think these look good together, like this. I wouldn't display myself personally. It's not something for me. Big Bang Theory is fine. Like it can be on TV and I'll watch it. And I think it's great, but it's not something for me. There is another pixel figure and it is Marty McFly, Back to the Future. Again, these pixel figures just don't really do it for me. I like the artwork because the DeLorean's awesome, but this pixel figure, nah. It's wearing the outfit that Marty McFly wears in the movie, so that's how I know it's Marty McFly, but. Yeah. <laughs> The other two items, I have like a love-hate relationship with these things. It is Eagle Moss, of course, and it's Star Trek ships. I don't know what ship this is. I have to have a look at the base. It tells you on the base. This is Varklas, am I pronouncing that correctly? V-A-H-K-L-A-S. Varkless, Varkless. Not sure what that's from. It's this ship. I like them. I don't like the fact that they're not to scale, so they're all different scales. A trans, a trans, a one, like a, a one-person pilot ship would be the same size as this ship, and it's like, oh, and this ship, I'm assuming, is a lot big, bigger. So, one, two. There's another one. This one looks interesting. I've not seen. I don't think I've seen this ship before. It's a very interesting shape. And you can see that there. This is Renegade Borg ship. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's, I'm used to the Borg cubes, but Renegade Borg ship. Hmm. Interesting. I do. Here's the thing, Eagle Moss. I don't like their figures, but the vehicles, they're pretty well detailed, and. Both of these are pretty good detailed. I like the detail on them. I think they do look good. I wouldn't collect them though because I don't have the space for all of these ships. I keep getting them every single month, keep getting ships. If you're a huge Trekkie fan, then it's brilliant. 
me, I like Star Trek. I wouldn't class myself as a huge Trekkie fan. I have watched a lot of it. I do like it. I will happily watch it. But... Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Value, this one's box. Probably. These are £10 each, I believe. Or... I'm guessing. Someone... Comment, like, share, subscribe. All normal YouTube stuff. Somebody let me know how much these ships actually are. I should probably look them up. I'd imagine they're about £9.99 each. Or, but I'd imagine they'll come with a magazine with them. Like an Eagle Moss subscription thing. This and a magazine for £9.99. Maybe these are seven ninety nine each. I don't know. I haven't got a clue. I guess like a big set like that would be £12. And one like this would be £4. But the value's there. Item wise though. I've got to say it's not for me. What do you think? Like I said, I've already said it. Comment, like, share, subscribe. But what do you think? Is this worth it? I I really feel like my Geekbox just isn't there anymore. Just don't seem to be... I just seem to be grabbing old stock, stock from the shelves. And yeah, the value's there. Put it in a box, that'll do. Quite miss the old theme days, I think, when I used to do themes. Which I never thought I'd say before. I thought when you, I thought when you remove, it, remove the theme... And remove a t-shirt it would open you to more ideas to put in there or to put more value in there but i feel like all they've done is just remove the t-shirt and the theme and not put anything else into it uh yeah disappointing month this one for me but maybe you liked it let me know i'm gonna end it here i'm the geeky even as always much love until next time stay awesome